Get things rolling once again here. This is qualification match number four at the Sundome District event. We just saw one of the most optimal matches. We'll see what the follow-up here is in this one. Already a dominating autonomous period here by the Red Alliance. 24 points on the board. It was very nearly 29 there. The Stormbots just a couple millimeters wrong on that last note score. They'll pick up their own rebound and drop it off in the one-point low-goal amp there and get right back at it. Mapton Lugnuts are also on that Red Alliance. They just had a pretty great showing last week at the Auburn District event. We saw them actually be an Alliance captain in the playoff rounds and go quite a long ways in that event. See what they have in store for us here in this one. So far, 29 points on the board. They lead by five. Blue Alliance now starting to catch up. There's the Dragons out of Spokane at 1595. Bot just picked up two points for the Alliance score. And now Cheney Circuit Cyclone, formerly known, I believe, as Error 4104, drop off a one-point note into the bottom right amp there for the Blue Alliance, and then they will slowly walk on over, not quite fully caffeinated this morning, to the Alliance station. They actually leave some room for the Dragons to get in there. Dragons now with a note, and they'll race off down the field past these two Red Alliance machines. Stormbots for two. Will their Alliance partners follow it up? That looks like a no from Titan Robotics Club. Their safety light is still blinking. They are still connected, uh, but just having some difficulties getting things moving here. One stack light good there for Red. Now make that two amp bonus unlocked. Here comes Mabton lining up for the layup at the Alliance speaker. Human player, wait for it, wait for it. There we go. And that should have been a five point. Now followed up by another five point, ten point cycle total between Mabton and the Stormbots there on Red, extending their lead now to 12 points with 38 seconds left to play. There's the 4125 machine, confidential out of Umatilla, making their way to the loading zone now. A human player launches a note in, and they're actually pre-staging them. So the robot picks up off the floor. Human player drops a note back onto the floor so that next time the robot can just come in and scoop it on up. They get that two-point layup successfully and now they will go scoop up one remaining note from right in front of the Red Alliance loading station before going over to their stage. Stormbots, Red, heading up airborne, hopefully, especially since their human player has spotlit that robot. Bingo, not bingo. They fall back to the floor right as the buzzer sounds. That would have been worth four points. Instead, it's worth one. And we're going to have three Blue Alliance robots parked under the stage there for a total of three points, unless that Dragon's Machine is... Supported by just the stage there. I can't see from this angle. But in that case, it'd be a total of five over there. We'll be back with your results in just a moment. Number four, it's a Red Alliance victory, 57 to 45. Well played by both sides there. Three ranking points for each of our Red Alliance teams, two for winning the match, one for the Melody bonus there. Just an onslaught of notes scored, a Melody worth. And we'll be back with match number five.